Hello, my relatives. Guys, all this squad you make up. Baby can dance so we go make Leech Lake Tribal College. One, two, three, four, and then turn, and you turn and say right here, John, don't, don't step towards me yet, and just look at each other. One, two, three, four, then come together, come together, and then. I'm by your side like the woman always nearby. But I know you're going to read that slower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. It's going to be really good. I think it's going to be really good. And understand that the audience wants to hear you and they want to see you be passionate. That's the truth. You grab a piece of bread like this. <laughs> so we're going to try to lift you up today. So one thing is that we passed out a love quiz. We want you to answer that. And then in a little while, we'll show you the answers. The Ojibwe word for love is Zagaiduin love. In Ojibwe, the person who walks beside you, your significant other, is? You know what Mujid is, right? Nanabushu is our teacher. Maja, she is leaving. That's our Ouija wagon. When my heart is breaking, I should. All of the above. Don't dwell in it. Don't get lost in it. You can cry about it, lament. Larry Aiken says maybe four times, just let it all out hard. Let it out. And then do something else to take your mind away. Go outside, breathe, and be grateful. Take a walk and listen to the birds sing. Hug your children and tell them how much you love them. Gishue Nimen means I love you. Gishue Nimen. Now turn to the person on your right and tell them, ooh, you're special. <laughs> Thank you, ooh. <laughs> now turn to the person on your left and shake their hands and tell them, Gishue Nimen, I love you. Person on your left. <laughs> and now please, wild applause because you all passed the test and you're loved. <laughs> okay, we have a stellar a uh, writer here in our midst, her name is Melanie Anderson. Anin Wawashki Zibing in Dunjiba, Melanie Erickson in Dinjikas. Old love. He still smelled the sweet grass in her hair, no longer like a raven's wing, but silver like the winter fox. He still caressed her skin like the first time, no longer smooth like a lily pond, but scarred like a fallen bough. He still held her hips, no longer round like a ripe seed, but hollow like an empty gourd. He still kissed her belly, no longer promising to bud, but barren like an unquenched field. He still cupped her breasts, no longer firm beneath turquoise and silver, but withered like the last summer rose. 
He still held her hand, no longer supple like the reeds, but gnarled like pinion pine. He still looked into her eyes, no longer glistening like the morning dew, but shadowed with life's joys and sorrows. He still lies beside her, with all his love around her. In each other's eyes, still sees the trust and dreaming that kept them tied. He still stays beside her, no longer love can show her, but on the hillside smells the sweet grass through his song and tears. Megwitch. This is Love Songs from Ojibwe Heritage by Basil Johnston. A man and a woman lament their love for each other because their parents won't let them be together for the first time until they each prove they are worthy of each other. It will take one year to be in each other's physical presence. Gawin Bukanazid Geneta Bishigainamin, Kego Gushkain Dangin, Kego Mawikain, Banima Api Ejaminan, Inga Bizamo Dee, Inga Bunanandam. Dibishko Bidanakwak Abi Eja, Dibishko Wapanakwak Apachi Macha, Ningashkandam Ga Bijo Ejad, Ningashkandam Ga Ego Machad. Ningi Mikawig, Ninga Abi Nanegina. When I go ze, Dibishko Anang. Wasa when I go ze, Dibishko Anang. I care for no one else. I care only for you. Do not be sad. Do not cry. I will come for you. Only when I come to you will my heart be at ease. Will my heart be at peace? Like a cloud he has come and gone, like a cloud gone forever. Sad am I since he came, sad am I since he's gone. He has found my love, will he return from my love? Like a star within my vision, like a star beyond my grasp, my love. Gwichi win dibishko mang apane ea. I am by your side like a loon, always nearby. It's called Heart to Heart. Um, sometimes in this lifetime, we meet a special soul who lives with our very essence to almost overflow. We drink the cup of friendship, it tastes like ruby wine. And you know within your heart this means, this meeting was divine. This soul that lives within your heart, no distance, Distance can prevail, an inner spark within the heart becomes a holy grail. The starting of a journey in which you both shall be a reflection of each other for all eternity. Miigwech. Hi, my name's Chris Drift, my check. Uh, my name's Christopher Drift and I, have, I don't like speaking in public or in a group setting. But since Elaine put me on front street, I figured I'd do something about it. <laughs> the topic today, the topic today is love, which makes it even harder to speak <clears throat> today, so bear with me. Love to me is completely not understandable. I don't know why it's so easy for me to fall in love. It seems like my heart reaches out for people. I like, <clears throat> I like love. It feels good being able to share with someone else like life experiences, being able to learn from one another, help each other out, share hard times with, good times together, and create memories that will last a lifetime. Sometimes I wish I don't, <clears throat> sometimes I wish I wouldn't fall in love from past experiences, got my little heart broke a few times, even though I shouldn't let <clears throat> what some other female did to interfere with whatever I might have going on right now. My biggest belief about love is that it should be an emotion that everyone should experience at least once. Never <clears throat> never know you might like it. Love is something that should be found more often and should be cherished instead of taken advantage of. Anywho, love in my own words is complicated, confusing, misunderstood, and the best feeling in the world. 
Yeah. We want to be healthy and fit and around for a long time living this good life with me, dear Johnny. I love you when you take my hand and tenderly kiss it and everyone in the Mikina Thursday lecture series is watching because then, Johnny, I know you are proud of me and our love. I love you in the future, too, when I will see you walking down the aisle with your cap and gown, graduating with your Associate of Arts degree in Indigenous Studies, <laughs> with your financial aid applications all complete for fall 2011, because you're transferring to a four-year college in Bemidji Gamag, because you want nothing but the best for me and my children. Oh, Johnny, I love you always and forever, my sugar honey pie. <laughs> That's how much I love you. I'm a loving star for you. Through the years of college education, I felt lost and confused, but with your love beside me, I never lost the hope. When I see our future children, I know then that what I've done is for the betterment of both myself and our next generation to come. That's awesome. <laughs> And a bunch of friends, people that I had known for a long time, and people that we had just kind of gone out to dinner with, you know, kind of a, it was kind of a barn family because my daughter was a horse rider and we all were friends, and we decided we were going to go out and celebrate New Year's. And so we went to this hotel in a very small town, and at midnight, I walked outside and took my shoes off and stood in the cold grass and looked at the Creator and said, I think I've had all I can handle. And I asked for some help. And I went in and I asked one of my friends, his name's Daniel Rogers, if he would dance with me. He had never danced a single time in his life, but he got up to dance with me. And when he held me in his arms, I said, it feels so good to be held by a good man, and we've been married for 10 years. Some of you, I will see you walking around, and I tell my son, I say, look at that person. We just passed three girls leaving. I said, someday, you know, you're going to be here. The young people that we're talking up here, how brave you are to get up and do stuff, you know, to talk and to take Elaine's class and, and to come here, and you just help all of us be more able to love. Love is just really a cool thing and I'm very thankful that I'm able to love and I I love my husband so much and I know that he loves me and I love my son and I just, I really do, I'm a visitor here but I do love Leech Lake. Miigwech. I just want to say miigwech for all the love and for all you people coming. Lake Tribal College provides quality higher education grounded in Anishinaabe values. Me, which.